Hi, it's Takeshi from JPRail.com. Thank you very much for tuning in my channel. The Shinkansen is a high speed train operated by JR companies for long distance passenger transportation in Japan. The Shinkansen is also sometimes called a bread train. The speed is much faster than the conventional line. The Shinkansen is now an indispensable transportation system for travel in Japan. Then, when and how was this Shinkansen built? I always talk about rail travel in Japan, but this time I will talk about the history of the Shinkansen. Let's find it together. The Shinkansen is also sometimes called a bread train due to its plan before World War II. The Limited Express Train Asia, which was operating in Manchuria before the war, was operated at the maximum speed of 130 km per hour. And the plan of the bread train was designed based on these technologies. Although this plan failed after the end of the war, Many human resources involved in this plan were invited by JNR, the Japan National Railways, and played a major role in Japan's railway development. In 1955, Shinji Sogo, who was later said to be the creator of Shinkansen, became the president of JNR. Sogo also invited Hideo Shima who was involved in the development of the train to become the chief engineer of JNR. Based on the post-war technological development of the bread train plan, they greatly promoted the later Shinkansen plan. On the other hand, train had started to shift from locomotives that pulled the passenger cars to trains that incorporated some electrical vehicles. Originally, there were many weak road beds on Japanese railways, and the heavy weight of locomotives placed a heavy load on the railway tracks. Another reason was that the electric train was suitable for Japan's railway situation, as it had several electric cars built in and the weight could be distributed. In 1957, JNR introduced the new commuter train 101 series. This is a vehicle that completes the style of the current commuter train with a 20 meters length body and four double doors. In 1957, Odakyu Electric Railway, which is a major private railway company, completed the new Limited Express train 3000 series, which is also called Super Express in cooperation with the JNR Technical Research Institute. A speed test run was conducted on the JNR railway line, which has a longer straight line section than Odakyu Electric Railway line, which has many curves, and achieved the world highest record of 145 km per hour on the 1067mm narrow gauge at that time. The data obtained in this test run greatly advanced the realization of a long-distance train operation by an electric train. In 1958, JNR built the new Limited Express Train 151 series and started operation at the Limited Express Kodama, which operated between Tokyo and Osaka. The trip time for trains towed by locomotives was 7 hours and 45 minutes while Kodama reduced the travel time to 6 hours and 50 minutes. Kodama shortened the travel time by 40 minutes. Then, 151 series train recorded the maximum speed of 163 km per hour, demonstrating the great potential of an electric train again. And then, the travel time between Tokyo and Osaka has been further reduced by 10 minutes to 6 hours and 40 minutes. 
The limited express Kodama had been well received, and it is said that it was so difficult to reserve a seat. Around this time, with the post war reconstruction, the shortage of transportation volume on the Tokaido main line connecting the Tokyo and Osaka had almost reached the limit, and it was urgently necessary to add new routes. There was also a plan to make the current Tokaido line multiple lines, but JNR engineers adopted the wider standard gauge 1435 mm and operate the train based on the result of the Super Express and the Kodama's test run. These show the possibility to reach Osaka in three hours. JNR President Sogo found the future of the railway in this potential and began working on the government. And the JNR chief engineer Shima led the high speed railway plan from the technical aspect. In 1958, the construction plan was approved by the Japan government, and next year the line started to construction. In 1962, the high speed train test line was built near Odawara and recorded 253 km per hour in the test run by a train set 1000 series. This 1000 series is the prototype of Zero series, which became a commercial car later. The result of this test run demonstrated that widening the track width is expected to further increase the speed. By the way, although the bread train plan before the war had failed, a lot of land acquisition was in progress at that time, and it is said that this helped greatly in the construction of the Shinkansen. The reason why such a large project was completed in just five years was that a huge amount of land had been secured in advance. In 1963, JNR President Sogo, who led and promoted the high speed railway plan, pursued the responsibility for exceeding the construction budget and was unable to extend the term, and resigned as a president. Shima, who was invited by Sogo and became the chief engineer, also resigned with Sogo. They were not invited to the Shinkansen opening ceremony, which was completed the following year. However, when the history of the Shinkansen was talked about later, the heartless deeds of this JNR came to be told. It has become one of the biggest mistakes in the history of the JNR. In 1973, JNR once again celebrated Sogo's achievements and built a monument at the tip of the Shinkansen platforms of tracks number 18 and number 19 at Tokyo Station. When Sogo saw this and once said, I don't look like. On October 1st, 1964, the first ever Shinkansen finally opened. It was the current Tokaido Shinkansen that connects Tokyo and Shin Osaka. At this moment, the history of the Shinkansen had begun with Zero Series, the world's first high speed rail car. When the Tokaido Shinkansen was opened, first trains passing through many stations were named Hikari and the trains stopping at all stations on the Shinkansen were named Kodama. The name of the limited express train that was landing on the Tokaido main line until then was taken over by the Shinkansen. Now on the Tokaido Shinkansen, the fastest train is named Nozomi, but Nozomi was introduced later. The maximum operating speed of the Shinkansen at that point was 200 km per hour, and Hikari connected the Tokyo to Osaka in 4 hours. The travel time for the limited express Kodama running on the Tokaido main line was 6 hours and 40 minutes, so the travel time was dramatically reduced. The Shinkansen was the world's first high speed railway, and the world was amazed at its high technical capabilities. Along with the development of aircraft and the highways, the decline of railways had begun around the world. 
but the Shinkansen served as a trigger for the rehabilitation of railways and then high speed railway such as France high speed train TGB and the German high speed train ICE were constructed in various parts of the Europe. In 1965, the Shinkansen increased the maximum speed to 210 km per hour, and the travel time from Tokyo to Shin Osaka was reduced to 3 hours and 10 minutes. Currently, the maximum speed of the Tokaido Shinkansen is 285 km per hour, and the travel time has been reduced to 2 hours and 30 minutes. The Chuo Shinkansen is scheduled to open in 2028. This Shinkansen line will be operated by the next generation Maglev train, runs at a maximum speed of 505 km per hour. After opening the Tokaido Shinkansen, JNR gradually expanded the Shinkansen network. The Sanyo Shinkansen opened between Shin Osaka and Okayama in 1972. And it opened between Okayama and Hakata in 1975. The Tohoku Shinkansen and the Joetsu Shinkansen opened in 1982. Even after JNR was privatized and became JR, many Shinkansen lines, such as the Hokkaido Shinkansen, the Hokuriku Shinkansen, and the Kyushu Shinkansen, opened, and there are many more Shinkansen lines under construction. At the end of this video, I will tell you about the origin of the name of Shinkansen. The original purpose of the Tokaido Shinkansen was to increase the transportation capacity of the Tokaido main line, which was a problem with insufficient transportation capacity. If you write the Shinkansen in Japanese, it's like this. The first letter is read as Shin, which means new. And the other two letters are read as Kansen, which means main line. So the name of the Shinkansen means new main line. It does not mean high speed railway at all. In next video, I'd like to talk about the Shinkansen's current network and the past and the present vehicles. If you found this video useful or interesting, please click the like button. And it will motivate me. Also, since there are various videos useful train travel in Japan on this channel, please subscribe to my channel. Please also see other videos. Thank you very much for watching my video. See you guys next time. Arigatou gozaimashita. Sayonara.